I've seen these storefronts countless times before. Uh, yes, Ebenezer. But um, have you ever really looked at them? Of course I have. Have I not eyes? <laughs> it would appear so. Along with a big old schnauzer, it seems too. <laughs> Um, but uh, they are, they're, they're, it's spiritual eyes, Ebenezer, spiritual eyes. Angel, what am I to derive spiritually from this scene? Much, Ebenezer, much. For they represent the spirit of giving. <laughs> <laughs> Which you would do well to learn. They represent merchandisers commercializing the Savior's birth. Profiteers and hypocrites, a lot of them. <laughs> now listen to me, Ebenezer. If I were you... <laughs> Which, thankfully, I am not. <laughs> I wouldn't judge things beyond my narrow understanding. Greed has left you deaf and blind to life, and those who live it. You'd better hope you are never judged so harshly. <laughs> Why am I speaking in my Sean Connery voice right now? <laughs> hey, let's get this party moving along, shall we? All right, Angel, wait, 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 wait. where are we going? Oh, uh, well, to visit your only sister's son, of course, Bob Cratchit. Uh, Bob Cratchit. Uh, he follows me even in my dreams. I have no desire to spend Christmas with my idiot nephew. But think of the benefits, Ebenezer. It costs you nothing, which uh, I'm sure is good for you. But, Angel, uh, can, can they see me? Um, they cannot, which I'm sure is good for them. <laughs> Ah, uh, oh, angel. Observe, Ebenezer, observe. <laughs>